that's next to the tower. So, okay, here we are. Everywhere in. A mislaid egg. Until next time. Oh dear, this is a tricky one. We need you to relocate an egg to somewhere that Ronan will be certain to notice it. It may sound odd, but his discovery of that egg sets into motion the events that will free Alexstrasza from the old horde and save the egg too. We're sending you to Dunagas. That's not where any of this should be taking place. But time is like cheese right now, tasty and full of holes. Oh, and here's some sand. It'll help you to remain, help you, it'll help you to be a bit more stealthy. I'm a rogue, Romy. But sure. Um, I hate these quests that require the player character to be stealthy when you're a rogue because it's like your rogue powers no longer exist and you're good at the stealth thing, or you should be. Um, find the red dragon egg and place it somewhere conspic someplace conspicuous. Now, this quest was changed on the PTR. There was a, a lot of anger about it. And right, right, rifle. Uh, just so you know, I'm, ha I'm one of those who approves of the change. Um, originally was, you were supposed to help the old horde find the demon soul the dra yeah the demon soul at that point which is a device that well in the original lore deathwing was not directly responsible at least not not in the not in the the information provided in the official strategy guide of warcraft 2 which i have in front of shared um and they never left after after that war either. They had captured Alex Straza. Uh, and they basically forced her to breed and lay eggs. And that's as terrible as it sounds. Um, against her will by threatening the lives of her young. And I mean, it was a catch-22 because what ended up happening is the, the eggs she did lay they were interested in the uh, the, the weldlings. They were not interested in um, the grown the, any of the adults, except what they needed for mating purposes. Uh, this is and and they were used to fight in the Second War. Now, um, Warcraft Two is a real time strategy game. If you don't know, it and it's the first time you hear of Alexstrasza or Deathwing for that matter mentioned. Um, Alexstrasza, and you get a unit for the Horde, which allows you ma um, flying um, units. Uh, Alliance got Griffins uh, with the Wild Hammer clan. Uh, but the, the Dragons got Dragon Roosts. Um, and here's a description for the unit. I'm not, visual range 3, hit points 500, build time 150, gold cost 1,000, lumber cost 400, armor 20. Mighty chains of adamant, adamantine steel bind the most powerful creature in all of Azeroth, Alexstrasza the Dragon Queen. Captured and ensorcelled by magics contrived by the Dragonmore clan, there's no mention of Deathwing here, the great dragon is kept in a constant state of weakness and pain. As the unwilling slave of the Horde, the queen is closely watched as she lays her precious eggs. The dragon moth clan then raise her young to fight for the horde. Her whelps are slayed when they become too powerful to be properly controlled. Constant efforts are made to break Alexstrasza's will so that her captors can master the control of more mature dragons. That is from Warcraft 2. Um, and there have been some arguments that Alexstrasza was more, n little more than a beast. Uh, that's not what you get from this. This is still, I think, in effect in, in current world lore, uh, but in Chronicles, it's um, the demon soul 
Dragon Soul. Um, it's what Neltharion, um, Deathwing created to defeat the other dragons around the time of the War of the Ancients. I forget what happened. Um, I'd have to look that up. But you actually have to go back in time to retrieve it to defeat Deathwing in the present during Cataclysm. So there was a little bit more about Akshaza. Um, there's no index. There is an index in here. Okay. No, there isn't an index. Oops. So there's no index. Uh, I thought that there might be something like part in the human campaign. But yeah, this book is, this is the official strategy guide. Um, the official strategy guide. It says so right on the cover. Official strategy guide from 1996 is where they're keeping Alex Trazo. And here, Dunagaz is not where it's supposed to be. So you're in a different spot. But it's, as she says, it's a little flexible. Ronan does get the his hands on the demon soul. He destroys it, according to lore. Um, which breaks the hold on Alex Straza. And, and that's kind of where it's syncing up. The original quest had you getting the demon soul so that the old horde could enslave Alex Straza. So it was earlier in this timeline. And people had a problem with that. And they were absolutely positively right to do so. Um, I'm not against having the whole that sometimes bad things to ha have to happen for other things to happen be part of be part of the gameplay. I am against players being forced to be complicit in what is essentially sexual assault. Um, if you want that in a game, I'm sure, you know, uh, there's plenty of games you could do that in. I'm, I, I believe Grand Theft Auto, you get hit points back for um, doing terrible things uh, to sex workers. But um, this is not that game, and nor should it be. Don't play a terrible game. Don't be a terrible person, in my opinion. Uh, a lot of people, it's just a game. It's a fake character. It's like, this This is a game that a lot of people have been playing for a really long time. It's part of their lives. Some form attachments to characters. It's like unhealthy attachments. But, you know, you, you read... Some people actually get involved in stuff and have emotions and feel. And don't feel that emotions are bad things or that compassion is a bad thing or a character flaw. Some people do. Uh, but um, I live in the United States. It's a prevailing theme. But... Um, what they changed it to is they allow you... While the bad stuff does still happen, they're not changing the past plot. That all still happens. Uh, and I know some folks had a, had a problem with that. Like, why can't we prevent that? Um, why can't we just stop that from ever happening? Or Like, I think... It's so interwoven with the lore now that you can't really do that. Just when you... If you're gonna revisit it, you gotta do it right. I think this is a good solution. And allows you to actually help save Alex Straza, which is what I want to do, both as a player and as my character. Now, I'm sure all those wandering around with Sylvanas is right and Garrus is right, um, names of hordes or whatever they got, they probably differ. Uh, but in this case, I think they chose the right solution. So we are going to accept this quest. And we're going to do the right thing. I have to be stealthy. Alright. So I'm saying that piece. I'm not going to argue with anyone about it. If you have a different opinion about it. Um... The only opinion I want to hear is someone who feels like they should have kept it out of the game entirely. That is valid. If you're like, no, I should be allowed to participate in the um, assault of a major character in the game, fuck off. All right, here we go. <laughs> I have the skill, but fine. <laughs> As I took everything on the hero's board, I actually have 
Of course, behind me. Sure, let's use your stealth. I just wanted to see if I could get. Nope. I was curious to see if, like, it's phased. It's a phase. Anyway, sneaking into Dylan guys. I mean, I'm a rogue. I see people don't know how to rogue. There it is. It's already in a conspicuous place. The times I've carried eggs in this expansion. Where am I putting it? That's more conspicuous than, okay, sure. I just stealth in my stealth. So just take the portal back. So that is the extent. <laughs> because I can. Oh wait, what's over there? Something not conspicuous. I'm a rogue. I know how to get around this stuff. Easy peasy. I'm just gonna steal some money off you. Hope you don't mind. Because I can. There. Joy. I'm out. And there's the egg. And that seems to be the entirety of that quest. Which is far preferable. <laughs> oh. Hello. There was also some complaints about the dialogue that was used that Chromie was a little bit too jokey to I will listen. Safeguard all life. Hey Chromie. Oh, why hello? A mislaid egg. Good luck on your next adventure. Did you find a good spot for the egg? <laughs> I I don't think it was, but it's what the game told me to do. It's been a pleasure. Did you get in the right spot? What am I saying? Of course you did, or we wouldn't be here. When Alstraza was freed, it secured a victory for the Battle of Grimbatol. More importantly, she and the other aspects forced Deathwing to beat a hasty retreat. If Rodan hadn't located her, who knows what Death Deathwing would have accomplished. Chromie lowers her voice, glancing at Alstraza. She arrived just after you left, like she knew what we were doing. Take care of yourself out there. Embrace hope. Alexstrasza stares at you for a moment, then offers you the smallest of nods and a gentle smile. Perhaps your involvement in her escape didn't go as undetected as you planned. She says nothing, but her gratitude is clear. Treasure the gift you have been given. I think this was a very elegant and great solution to a problem that listened to player feedback. Um, I don't care about people that don't care about plots and just want to be terrible people in games as, as well as life. But for those who are like, knows that this was part of the lore and one of then either one of the option to not have to do it or to be a part of a, the good solution, not to be part of the bad part of it. And um, yeah, um, I am satisfied with this resolution and that's that
that's that quest. Um, again, like I said, there was a lot of controversy about it. Controversy about it. A lot of people were upset, and it's. I, understandable and I agree with the complaints that were made. Um, a lot of people aren't happy with the solution. I think the solution works perfectly. And but again, you know, my experience is not with other people's experiences. Like I said, for those who think they should have the option to that, it's world of hugcraft. Supposed to be war. Bad things happen in war. It's not just that. If you want that, go back and play Warcraft 2 and Warcraft 3. Just kill stuff. With no emotion, no characterization. I would like to say that, but it's in those games too. It was my introduction to the world. But yeah. Um, anyone who's like, I think I, sh I think players should be complicit to like a terrible thing. They keep pointing to, to culling a Strathholm. Here's the thing. Arthas was not wrong for killing, going into Strathholm and purging it. Where he was wrong was not waiting, because <laughs> they were gonna they were gonna turn any moment. He went in while people hadn't turned yet. That's where he was wrong. Strathholm did have to be purged, or else there would have been a lot more undead to deal with. So it needs to be contained, though, and purged you know, after they turned, not before. So, but again, the chances of actually encountering um, a city with some plague grain that will turn them into undead is not something that's necessarily going to happen in most people in their real life. Um, SA happens a lot. Uh, and people should not be forced to be complicit in it. And if you want to, you want the option to be complicit in it, you're a trash human being, and you can fuck off. So, that is my only statement about that. I will not argue with anyone with that point of view. So, onward!